yeah. What's up, Boom? Hey, babe. Pull my keyboard out a little bit. Oh, yeah. It's Friday morning. Which means it's pretty much the weekend. What's up, Frosty? Good morning. Let's just restart. RNG. <laughs> RNG could have put a jump pad right in front of me. Literally like 10 feet from me. It didn't. And then I hesitated on the warp portal. Which could have put me anywhere. And it, you know. Bad RNG. So bad. I'm only going to be picky with, like, that first starting wave, you know. If we can get a good start on that. I watched the video of the guy that's got, like, the number one spot. He spawns in on Sanatorium with Defend as the mission. And he's, like, fairly close to the main building. He's really close to a motorcycle, so he just rides right in there and gets it started. He also pauses the game or the timer on all the warps, like even warping into holdout, which I've got to remember to do. Because that's a big, you know, that's probably at least 10 seconds each way. Warping in and warping out. Yeah, we need perfect RNG. We're going to quit. Glova. Also, I'm going to be using Ether Shroud instead of the vines. Should be all right. All teams. See, there could have been a jump pad right behind me. And there's not, and One then transports the all the way down the mountain. I trust you can assemble a search party. Terrible. Search Take a lap. This is me trying. This is me trying. <laughs> I feel like I slept last night, but I don't know. I don't know if I did. I woke up this morning feeling pretty good about it. Morning rain. Hope you're having a good Friday morning.
Fuck, I might need another hit myself. I don't know if I'm one toke over the line already or one tuck one toke under. I don't know. I'm feeling a little tired. Oh. <clears throat> yeah. All ops. Strike team deploying in the OZ. Ready for Whoa. asking. This is Dr. Strauss. One this game of my hates me. Harvester dude. teams is not responding to my radios. My team's already en route, Dr. Strauss. We're just going to go with it. This isn't as bad as I think. It's not as bad as I think it is. At least we got a truck. About to go piss people off in the DMZ. Uh-oh. Underestimated the dangers. I trust your team will not make the same mistake. Move quickly. Low quality Ethereum is worthless to me. And you purge the harvester to release the canister. They have the Ethereum, Strauss. Moving to the rocket. You are now experiencing restricted movement and impaired vision, yes? Ethereum crystals are not only heavy, they radiate. What's up, Harvey? Assistance. My research may now proceed unimpeded. Beacon site has been located, strike team. People just camp and you're not, you're like, not today, Isis. <laughs> Try avoiding Walmart. You don't like Wally World? Weaver, I'm having trouble reaching one of our data station research units. My team will handle this gray. We'll report Fucking it when we reach beard hair team. in my mouth, I think. I hope it's a beard hair.
No comment. See, this is kind of a far ways to go for a defend. Like, I could have had defend on Sanatorium, like I was saying, and it would have been mid-map. I'd have already had it going. This is bullshit. Right so far. for the station. Not me. We don't like hellhounds. They like the machine though. First of all, how? Fucking hellhounds. Bastard. Parts unknown. I can't look at that right now, obviously. What's up, Braden? Transfer successful. It's My Friday. Analysis immediately. <laughs> Hopefully, they might even learn something. Anomaly located. Ready when you are. It's Friday. Yeah, I'm feeling kind of tired as well. And I think I slept pretty good too, but I don't know. I'm just needing more. Need more sleep. And I can't do anything else.
Kelly says, smash the like button to find out what she bought me. I already know. God, I'm getting all the slow fucking objectives. Braden smashed it. A double double beer helmet? Fuck yeah. Make sure the rover crosses the I think I had one of those one, once. Any intel it recovers will be key to our understanding how the dark ether affects organic matter. You'll need to stay with the rover as it searches for a stable breach. Yeah, that is pretty awesome. No new sword, Lewis. Not at this time. You got yourself a treadmill? Oh, good. Brayden. <laughs> Yeah, we'll be able to do a lot with a second PC. Yeah, it's the, the Arthur. If you go to ready to ship, it's the Arthur. Yeah, our son got one from them a couple months ago, and he's really been liking it, so... And I've heard good things about him. From the various ads that I've seen about him. <laughs> His was like 1300 or something. It was right around that. 12 or 1300, I think. Now I'm gonna have to get a current version of Adobe and shit. It's gonna be fun. What can I say? I like green. Sometime next week, probably. Maybe next Wednesday. Probably next Friday. Dr. 
Where's it I gonna be? Thanks for the escort. Beacon site has been located. Right right there. Yeah, there are some cool ones on there. The Gandalf is pretty sick. I mean, it really doesn't necessarily matter what a PC looks like. I mean, I don't know. I might have to put this one in the camera region. You might have to do that, but... Mine, my PC is just down here under the desk, you know, and I hardly ever look at it. It's got lights that kind of go, they like rotate between a whole bunch of different colors. It's doing it right now. It's also 65 freaking pounds, and it dominates the underside of my desk. <laughs> New PC looks like it can take flight. Yeah, it's got like an instrument panel on it. Oh, shit. Let me stop I'm moving just for a second over here. I gotta pause the timer going into the holdout. I, I apparently didn't realize I could do that before. Look up the Alienware. It's like the Alienware Area 51 R2 or something like that. It looks like a giant fucking biohazard sign symbol almost but without I don't know just like the shape of one oh good a green hour I've had it since like 2015 The graphics card in my current PC is a fucking, it's like a GTX 980 Ti. I think it's a four gig. So, you know, I could play some PC games, but I can't put them at like the best settings or anything like that. And probably, there's probably some current games that I, I can't even play because it's that dated maybe not though i don't know but i'd have to play them at like a really low quality i'm not really sure i don't really use my computer for gaming like that i have here and there you know but i don't really and that's something i want to change you know that's why i'm getting such a, a powerful computer because i don't want to just have it for streaming but i want to be able to game and I don't know. I just, I don't know that console is gonna get much better. It seems like PC is really where it's gonna be for like the future of gaming. I don't think console's ever gonna go anywhere, but it's like, I don't know. You just have so much more variety and games are just overall better on PC. It's tough to admit being a, a console person for so long, but... This is it. Yeah, that was messed up, Braden, I know. I... Like, I think, you know, that's why there's the 21-foot rule, but he also just didn't know the situation. Like, if you... If you go back, it's like, he didn't even know if that was the guy that called. You know, he thought the guy that he was talking to initially was uh, the homeowner or the landowner or whatever. So, it's just a bad situation all around. 
He should have had a partner. It's, I don't know. There's so many ways that could have ha happened differently, but it's scary, man. It sucks. It's that quick. I feel bad for the veteran that had to step in too, you know, because he had to shoot and kill somebody and then watch another guy die. And that's a really fucked situation to be in because you want to do something, you want to help him, but there's nothing you can fucking do. Like when you see the surveillance video, when he gets stabbed, man, the amount of blood coming out of him, it's like th there's no doubt he's going to die. Like it just... Yeah, I think it's just sheer panic. Like his his feet couldn't keep up with what he was trying to do. Like he was just trying to run so fast. You know, sometimes you overrun your own footsteps. It's like a horror movie, dude. Like every horror movie has a trip in a chase scene, and it's it's because of that. It's you know, it's too bad. Like he, I don't know. I wish he could have quick draw and just shot him. But it's, you know, it's fucking where she goes. What's up, Keanu? Good Friday afternoon to you, sir. Yeah, that active self-protection, that's a pretty good one. I also watch, there's like police activity. They just show a lot of like body cam footage but they kind of usually will start out with like the 911 call and something like that you know a little bit of a lead up to it but i mean there it's like every day there's a video on there of somebody either attacking a cop and the cops getting hurt or or you know the person dying because the cops are gonna you know they're gonna shoot <laughs> was that no progress there was like seven zombies in here what's up Charlie good morning dude Beacon's going to be... Until it's going to be over here, though. Your assistance continues to be crucial. Don't screw me, game. Oh, you screwed me, you bitch. Beacon location has been Let me take this car.
Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna play MW3. Uh, <laughs> that's a good idea, Lewis. I challenge you, punks. To a no holds barred cage match. Twenty five of us are walking in, but only one of us is walking out. Requiem disruptor satellite has moved into position, ready to kick in the front door. Sending coordinates to the uplink terminal. Get the dimensional disruptor operational. Busy room in there. Best. When fired, the disruptor satellite will reach the dark ether and draw out an APAC HVT. Okay, game. I'm about to rage quit on some real levels, dude. This game is bullshit. Ether Shroud is supposed to launch you forward when you use it. And so I was expecting to be able to jump right there and clear that ledge. Because sometimes it'll put you through whole walls. Not today. I just want a fast time, you know? Don't quite have enough for gold gun yet. We can triple pack, though. it has not been good to us we'll see what it is for this you know because i did the zoo mask so now the the main objective could be anything right it could be a limb again which would be awesome it's transport it's not bad Yeah, it is weird looking. It's, it's, you know, takes up a lot of unnecessary space. And it's because it's an alien, you know, you can't really do anything to it. Like, I tried to upgrade the RAM in it, and I couldn't. Because I would have to go into, like, the BIOS of the motherboard and mess with things in there. And I don't really want to because I don't think I know how. <laughs> like, I'm not wanting to learn how to do that while messing with my computer. So, you know, maybe now that I'll have a new one, I might do it. Because I've got the RAM stick still. Like, I've got, I've got it sitting right over here in the box still. 
But I just, I wasn't comfortable doing it when it was like the only PC I had, you know? Yeah, it's basically a triangle. And it's super heavy. Like I said, 65 pounds, you know? So when you want to move it around, you don't want to set it down, like, hard. You want it to touch the floor as soft as possible, right? And gently placing 65 pounds under a desk is kind of an awkward lift. It's not bad. But it's, you know, it's a little, it's a little, I don't know, it's a little, um, unnerving, I guess, because you think you could just bump the ground too hard and break something. I don't know. Fuck up everything. Also, it's liquid cooled, so you know. I was always worried I'd drop it too hard and then it'd start leaking or something. Look, it's underground salvage. That can be there on any wave, you know, and it's like even if you don't have. Uh, death perception it's a good idea to just run over that spot right there because there's a lot of times I do it and I'll just see the salvage icon pop up you know so I know that it was there Trees. Crowd surfing. Mission accomplished. Primordial Ethereum collected. Requiem control. Okay, tree. You may proceed with launch. Internal guidance, solid check. Starting launch procedure. Launching in three. Shut the fuck up, alarm. System show good burnout. Rocket on course for delivery. One step closer to unlocking the secrets of the dark ether. Well done. Beacon site has been located, strike team. Where's my die machine at? I don't know. One of these elites has it still. Please be a fast objective. No holdouts, no escort. Shit. Spawn in here. It could be. Oh, let's retrieve. That could be fast. It could be okay. Field ops, I have lost contact with one of my Ethereum harvesters. Requesting strike team investigate. My team is already en route, Dr. Strauss. Like the undead got here before us. 
Strauss, my team will finish the job. Recover the Aetherium and load it into the extraction rocket. My men underestimated the dangers. I trust your team will not make the same mistake. Move quickly. Low quality Aetherium is worthless to me. And you, purge the harvester to release the canister. Damn you, disciple. I needed that truck. Oh shit, self-aid, that's scary. All right, well that truck is ruined. We had a small earthquake here, like a couple years ago. It was really small, you know, just enough to actually feel the ground wiggle around and I was like wow dude that is scary to think of that being enhanced Freaking beacon's gonna be. I think it's gonna be done here. But it could be over there. Hell, it could even be up there. The game hates me. Finally, once I have the Ethereum, my work may continue. Anomaly site located. Activate the beacon to proceed. Definitely slow on this run. Ooh, it's hold out. We've located a dimensional power node. Bad. Gross. We're definitely not getting anywhere close to the record. Actually, the record was already gone. The record for wave 10. Let's look at it. 32, 38. The fastest anyone's submitted for console is 45, 32. I'm sitting on like a 37 flat or something like that. Which would be third place. But I want, you know, you gotta have really good luck. It's it's really good RNG with the regions and stuff as far as how far you are from starting each objective, what objectives you get, all sorts of different things can happen along the way. So there's quite a bit of luck involved with having a fast run. So it'll take me some time, but I think I can get it. I'd like to shoot for like 30 minutes flat. Yeah, 32.38 is the time to beat. So if you see the timer go beyond that, we'll probably restart. So yeah, hold on a second. I'm not in a match right now. Let's just look at it, you guys. Some of you probably didn't actually 
look it up or want to because it's a lot of work. You don't want to just leave. But yeah, this is my new my new system coming. My new PC. It's going to have fans. I think 10 of them. And it's going to be green and shit. And I'm probably going to put it right here next to me on the desk. Unless it's really loud. I don't think it will be, though. It looks sweet, though. It's going to have a Core i7 14,700 KF. I don't know what that means. A fucking GeForce RTX 4080 Super. Again, don't know what it means. 32 gigs of RAM. 2 terabyte. I think that's a SSD. So yeah, it should be nice. It should do. It should do for another 10 years. I'm not sure what all that is on the front. Yeah, I might be able to change the lights. I don't know. It might it might be RGB or something. You live at what street and you're not home between what hours? <laughs> this thing has to be signed for by an adult. And it, that adult will be me. In one hand will be my pen. In the other will be a sword. <laughs> Do not try to steal my PC. I'm just hoping the delivery, like the whatever delivery service it comes with is, is gentle with it. I don't, I don't have good luck in that department. Like I got a 4K monitor once. It was from Amazon, so it could have happened anywhere, I guess. But I seriously, I get the thing. And, you know, you're looking at a, a box, right, that's like a rectangle on the top corner up here. The top corner, okay? The top corner of the box, this corner, the top corner, not the bottom corner, top corner, there was a whole bunch of grass that had somehow got jammed into, like, the seam of the box, which to me meant that this box had somehow landed on the ground upside down with my 4K monitor in it. And then... Mysteriously, one third of the screen of that 4K monitor didn't work. <laughs> so I had to send it back. Yeah, it's really awesome. Callie and I were looking at them last night and I was waffling. I was, I was thinking, you know, I'll just wait. I'm having trouble reaching one of our data station research units. Strike team, proceed to data site. But I probably shouldn't, honestly. And I guess the decision was made for me, because Callie said screw it and just ordered the damn thing. What's up, Ethan Hunt? How's it going, Mang? Your men are dead, Gray. Specimen's still intact. My team will perform the analysis. Don't forget to grab the specimen head. Yeah, I was pissing her off just out, looking though. at it last night because I was like, no she's no like, no click no next, no next, no and I'm just like, well, I'm not sure I want to go to next. You know, this, we're making some big decisions here. It's like just wanting my information, just wanting my shipping address and shit. <laughs> Once you 
pay off your bed. Oh yeah. In fact, you went somewhere to see what they were doing for WrestleMania. They're giving away hoodies, t-shirts, jerseys, basketball jerseys. Really cool stuff. That's pretty cool, Charlie. Hopefully you get some of that shit. So much damage to the machine. Let me go grab this though. Easy now, they're breaking my machine. Stop hitting it. You're in an unauthorized zone, Zambies. Ow. Oh, uh -oh look at that. I remembered I actually had this. That zombie was like over here, like he could smell me. See, I knew he's somewhere. We barely made it. it. Doctor. Genetic data transfer confirmed. Appreciate the effort, strike team. Cheers. Beacon site identified. Proceed when ready. No! I hate it already. I hate it. It's a bad start. It's a bad start. It's a bad start, you guys. We're, we're gonna restart. Unless this, is, unless this is like a limb and it's close. Ah, it's hold out. Fuck that. Start. Restart emote. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot. don't leave a nail in the salad what does that happen before they've given away action figures too that's badass 
keep them things in a box. Just sounds all oh, like a fingernail. I was thinking like a metal nail. Like what sick bastards bringing in little little roofing nails and putting them into garden salads. But yeah, a fingernail would be pretty gross too. <laughs> Welcome back, strike team. Let's go get him. Field ops, this is Strauss. ECM satellite evading launch. Understood, Doctor. Strike team a metal nail was found at a local up. restaurant in the food. That's dangerous. You must siphon essence from infected specimens. The capsules will convert the material into one of many dark ether objects. I'd say it happens on purpose, probably. I think in the 80s somebody found a finger or a fingernail or something in a can of pop. Finger in the chili at Wendy's? I don't, I I don't know. I don't think so. Beacon site has been located, strike team. Fucking chili, chili con Karen. Three ten. It was a scam. Oh, shit. Someone put their finger in the chili on purpose then. It's gross. It's retrieve. Immediately get off this boat. Shoot this mega liquor. Copy that. Take this raft. I don't think I have any grapples though. Strauss, my team will finish the job. Harvest 
canisters are nearby. You'll need to detach the Aetherium canisters before loading them into the rocket. Aetherium samples are essential to my work. Handle with care. It is not entirely stable. Harvester purge is stable. required for canister release. Move quickly. Low quality Aetherium is worthless to me. Aetherium sample acquired. Besides being quite heavy, the way Strauss says stable is so fucked up. Get up there. Come on. Come on, prompt. I hate not having grapples, dude. This could be ten times faster if I had got some. Like, it barely lets you move. Go, Rambo. You slow son of a bitch. Some people are born scammers and born smashers. System show good burnout. Rocket on course for delivery. Yeah. Finally. Once I have the Ethereum, my work may continue. Beacon location has been I was a born smasher. For sure. Wait, well, can't do that. Born to smash. <laughs> Hold out. Field off. We've identified a crystal power node in your vicinity. Coordinates marked. Power node will be neutralized. Fuck. Enemy hide identified. Engagement is your call. Plant the charges on the dark ether crystal. We need that portal closed yesterday. Do not be afraid. Prompts that don't work. Prompts that aren't prompt.
We're just hanging out. Someone just sent you flowers. Oh, good. It's probably one of your weird neighbors. I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. Frosty, frosty, frosty. <laughs> Who did you what? interact with? My eye is itching like crazy. I think I got an eyelash in it. I do. It's terrible. I think it's just the shape of my eyes or something. They're little shit collectors. I also have like really long eyelashes and they constantly fall out. Like my whole life I've been pulling eyelashes out of my fucking eyes. And my eyes are really sensitive too. Like if I get anything in there, I'm just like uh, uh. <laughs> fuck. Big eyes equal big balls. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. I know, I'm sitting here thinking, what part of my butthole do I gotta show to get my rent paid? Like, fuck. I'll do it. Show the, I'll show you the whole thing. Make sure you don't need anything from there. Can't afford it. <laughs> I mean, we're talking paying mortgages here. If anyone finds a metal nail in a salad or any type of food, that's a violation. That's a food code violation. Damn right, Charlie. And you would know because you work at a restaurant. Hell yeah. Shave the beard and I'll pay the rent for a year. Fuck that. Weaver, Requiem Disruptor Satellite in position. I can't do that. Our team's on route to the uplink. Bring the dimensional disruptor online. I will, however, shave my butthole. <laughs> I 
just trying to see if I can get anyone to spit their coffee out this morning. Apex targets with high Ethereum concentrations and extracts them from the dark ether. Connection established, systems nominal. Locking target. Initiating firing sequence. Yeah, I think if there's a nail in the food, someone brought that from home. Firing in three, two, one. Someone's screwing around. Shoot him right in the head. Well, that didn't do much, did it? This is why I prefer the death machine. Even my Howard does more than that war machine. At least to him. Since we're going by the zoo mask, let's hit it. Can you imagine biting into a nail? Like, you would definitely crack a, at least one tooth. Apex threat eliminated, Carver. Another good kill, strike team. That'll send a message. The beacon's nearby. Activate when ready. Might have been faster just to grab a motorcycle and fly. Let's see, we need to go two pack. Thrower. Looks like a normal wall nail. Oh, good. Escort. meant to be, I guess. Do your bit and help the rover through the gateway, okay? Stay with the rover as it scans for a stable dimensional entry point. Rossi, you might want to shop zombie tools. Just get you a nice sword. I mean, maybe not. You know, it might end up being used against you. That would be the worst thing. Buy some sword and then... Have it, have it used to kill you. But yeah, something needs to happen. I think you probably should just move to, to Montana. I, 
I've got two spare bedrooms. No one has to know. <laughs> I'm also just joking, Frosty. I'm sure you know that. I feel like I better say it. Better say it so I don't sound too creepy. I don't want to sound too weird. Maybe a little weird. Just a little weird. <laughs> Yeah, I would start, like, really training with a pistol. Maybe get one of those bra holsters. Detecting massive dark ether energy presence. I feel like women have better options for concealed carry. Let's get a dust strike team. Mainly because of the bra. That's it, Braden. We need to develop the man bra for real. For real this time. Men have struggled on with no support to the boobs throughout history. This oppression will no longer stand. Successful data link established. We're receiving now. Appreciate the help. Anomaly site located. Activate the beacon to proceed. My bra? Yeah. The man bra. We'll make them all tactical and shit. You know, you could have like all sorts of different things like the survival man bra. It's got like fish line and all sorts of cool shit in there. We'll make it seem real manly. I don't want to say this because it's creepy, but people are using the air tags as trackers. They can put it in your purse or car and track people. Yeah, that's true. And they're pretty small, right? Like, it'd be tough to find it. Could be on something that they gave you, like a mallard. Girl streamer you watch had a gift delivered to her P.O. box and it had an air tag and it tracked her to her house. Oh, good. I mean, you don't think they'd put an air tag on on a on a thing of flowers, would they? Now what? I'd say it's time to move to Montana. Look, now it put me right through the goddamn wall. Coming is what I mean. 
Frosty's gonna be like throwing everything she owns away. It's all air tagged. Get this couch out of here. Genetic data transfer confirmed. Appreciate the effort, strike team. Cheers. Beacon site identified. Proceed when ready. Collateral. I don't think we've had transport yet, so that's probably what it's going to be. Maybe. Could be anything, because I did... I think I did hit the zoo mask early. Yeah, it's transport. Energy researcher requesting strike team assistance. It would seem my mobile harvester team has forgotten how to use their radio. We'll search the area and find your team's trout.
for launch. Asset secured, controls. Proceed when ready. Launch sequence in progress. All systems go. Launching in three. to unlocking the secrets of the dark ether. Well done, you. Yeah, I'm sure people just pay people's rent all the time. It's nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm thinking we're going to be slow here. Firing in three. <clears throat> Looking at a Two. subpar run. Zombie boss. Plasma field perimeter established. Hope you're having a good Friday, dude. Fill the module of tanks and proceed to conversion. Make sure the module stays in one piece team. Essence capacity at 25%. Essence capacity at 50%. Essence capacity at 75%. Eat the hell out of some Taco Bell. Oh, yeah. gonna be where's the beacon gonna be it's either gonna be in the bear pit or over there so I'm gonna stay right here because I don't know bear pit anomaly site located activate the beacon to proceed You're gonna go there for lunch, Lewis? Oh, good. Good. We just wanna have Taco Bell and rub it in. Yeah, well, we're gonna go to Burger Express and they're gonna have the same thing we've ate for the last fucking 10 years. Field up. A dark ether specimen analyzer station has gone dark. Can you check in on them? Strike team, proceed to DASA site. It's defend, which will take three minutes. Failed! Too slow. Run over.
I'm looking forward to some sushi tomorrow. Plan for tomorrow. Me and Callie and Darcy are going to order up some sushi and eat it. And I don't think Darcy's ever had sushi before, so it's going to be kind of fun. It's going to be funny to see her reaction. Let's go to Taco Bell. You want to? Today? You want to say fuck it? We just go? We go, we go and get the always delicious. Callie and Ramsey go to Taco Bell. Don't fuck around. Is it possible? Let me try one more time here. at the top of the goddamn mountain. We're not doing it. Record all of it? What, the sushi? checks Roger sushi Taco Bell all of it just make a video of going to Taco Bell of riding in the car for an hour and a half that's the thing you get excited to go over there right and so you go and the trip over kind of goes by pretty quick because, you know, you're excited and you're just like, the further you go, the closer you are to getting the delicious Taco Bell. But then when you're coming back, it's like, it just takes so long and you just want to be home. You've already finished all your Taco Bell. There's nothing else to eat. There's nothing to do. There's no radio. There's nothing. You're just driving. Hey, Darce, we were just talking about you. We were just talking about sushi night tomorrow night. I'm excited. I want to have some some sushi. I have to get a bunch. Yeah. No jump pad. Field ops. I have lost contact with one of my Ethereum harvesters. Requesting strike team investigate. Copy that. Strike team inbound to their left. Boom. Oh yeah. Oh sweet. We came out of the portal in the right spot. I should have grabbed a motorcycle though. I still can. Still can. Yeah, it's a local restaurant. It's fairly decent. You know, they do they do alright. I don't wanna go sit in there though. 
So we'll probably just order a bunch of it and bring it home. Canister detached. Operator on the move. You are now experiencing it's always pretty busy in there. Oh my god, I can't shoot. What time should we order? I'm not sure. I don't know when they open. I would assume they open at like four or something, you know, if it's just for dinner. I have no idea. We could do it whenever though, probably like two, or not two, I just seen wave two on my screen and said two. Uh, probably like five or six or whenever you want. Strike team, get to the specimen analyzer and investigate. Defend it. Omega heal spotted. You're clear to engage. Your Spit your shit at me, mimic. Specimen still attacked. My team will perform the analysis. Once the specimen is in place, wasabi? Yeah, a little bit. I'll put a little bit on there sometimes. Some soy sauce for the soy. Christ, I cannot hit that friggin' playground. I'm gonna stab you! Jesus!
a little longer. My allergies are really acting up here lately. I, I must be allergic to something. I think it's just all the pollen. Like there's high pollen in the air. So my eyes and nose are really bugging me lately. It's fun. I think I'll probably put a lot of wasabi on my sushi just for that reason, actually. I kind of want something like that to clean my sinuses out. I would even willingly, willingly go into the gas chamber in boot camp again just to have that level of cleanliness of the, of the nostrils. That should be it. There is Doctor. nothing quite like that, actually. It's a weird thing when you come out of the gas chamber. You have like streams coming out of each each nostril. Like your your whole sinuses, everything purges like crazy, and it you you actually can breathe better after that for like a day or two than you ever have in your whole life. It's it's awesome. would be nice because right now my sinuses are food i've been taking claritin and using flow nays and all this different stuff and this nothing's working i just can't breathe out of like my right nostril at all ever it's gonna be retrieve oh it's a limb sweet requiem disruptor satellite has moved into position ready to kick in the front door our team's on route to the uplink. We'll bring the dimensional disruptor online. Kinda wish I had a uh, death machine, though. Be ready, strike team. Red Room satellite will bring an apex threat into our reality. Connection established. This is nominal. Locking target. Initiating firing sequence. Good to kill on site, strike team. All Apex targets are priority one. Firing in three, two, one. these commanders is no small feat but slowly we're making a dent in their forces anomaly site located activate the beacon to proceed
Duga. All right, meow. Welcome back, Ethan. License and registration. Chicken fucker! Bagot! Want me to say meow? Going pretty good, man. These zombies would die a little faster, maybe. I can need some speed cola.
signal locked. Run. That crystal has been shattered, Carver. Affirmative. Infestation spread has been contained. Shit, the beacon's right there. The beacon's nearby. Activate better come out right here, then. Nope, I came out way over there. Fuck. I could have just got a motorcycle and been way faster. Damn it. Damn it. Shit runs. Get your shit runs here. <laughs> stuff I think we take water for granted so much like people think of water as just this very basic thing I don't know I think there's a lot more to it not just water it's like some sort of life force or something a lot of people consume it in a diluted form via you know whatever their favorite beverages are but gotta get it straight from the source you ran down to the maintenance guy he's reviewing footage He's deleting the footage of him delivering the flowers. <laughs> it's like, shit, she's on to me. It's probably what you need to do, Frosty, is just befriend some guy around there, like the maintenance guy or something like that. You know? You don't have to do anything special for him or anything. Just fucking probably say hi to him and shit right and then kind of tell him you're like give him the damsel in distress routine and then you know at least you got somebody that's like knowing you know that there's a situation and potentially willing to step up and do something if so if somebody shows up he is your friend okay well that's good i was wasn't sure if maybe you know you're just like not really uh talking to people like that i don't know i know in in like the cities and stuff it's pretty common for people to just like not even know anybody like i didn't know any of my direct neighbors or anything when i lived down in texas like it was weird just felt weird but it all, you know, it was just the way it was. Like, it was weirder probably to go over there and introduce myself. Because people were just weird. I don't know. His family and him are so nice. And you've been over to their place before. Oh, okay. Well, it's definitely him then. No, I'm just messing with you again. <laughs> Get off the car, Zambi! Shit. Stuck in the linkage or something. Hire a bodyguard, a bodyguard like Kevin Costner in the movie, in the one movie. Also, Lewis is starting a bodyguard business. Also, I am applying for a job at Lewis's bodyguard business. In a stunning turn of events, Lewis and I will be moving to a different state and starting an entirely different career. What's up, Billy? Essence capacity at 75%. Oh, fast. Yeah, I like to think so, but it's tough, man. It's really a, a lot of RNG. Essence capacity at max. 
I ain't getting it. Well, hopefully you're having a good Friday. I do have a new PC ordered, which is pretty goddamn exciting. I've been using the same one here since like 2015 or I think about 2015. And it was an upgrade from my first computer. Like, the first one I had made for streaming was like a Windows 7 situation. All essence conversion complete. Unfortunately for you, the study of raw essence is currently restricted to the outbreak zones. I really wanted to try to grab that with the car, but... It wouldn't do it. Where are we going, Beacon? Anomaly site located. Activate the beacon to proceed. Yeah, I'll probably keep playing for the most part on console, but I want a new PC for the stream and stuff. I don't know. I'll probably play on it too because it's going to be badass. But... You got a body, we guard it. Oh, yeah. I do it manually, dude. I don't know how the fuck to make it do it automatically. I mean, I'm I'm on an Xbox here, you know. <laughs> like I don't know. I have no idea. I mean, I I it's on my computer, the timer, but I just have it hotkeyed. And I watched the world record run of this wave 10 shit and the guy is pausing his timer right here through this warp like going in to hold out I wasn't doing that before so you know that's a little bit of time saved but so far I've done like a 37 flat probably my best but the record's like 32 38 or thir something like that Yeah, I see people like like some of the bigger speedrunners, you know, they'll have like really crazy timers with a whole bunch of different intervals and stuff, and I don't understand how they do all that. One of these days I might have to learn, but that'd be kind of nice to have like a set of intervals, you know, that showed like what my wave times were for like wave one, two, three, and all that. Yeah, I know it's hard to remember to pause and unpause the timer well and it just takes you out of the game too I have to take a hand off the controller right at the start and end of the, the wave you know and it the ends not so bad because I'm just sitting there but at the start I want to be moving I want to be turning and, and making decisions and shit you know and it's like I have to push a button on my keyboard instead so I was looking at Elgato's stuff the other day, and they make a foot pedal. And I was thinking about maybe getting that. That would be somewhat useful. I could maybe map that to uh, like a pause timer situation. It's only like 80 bucks. 
Like, you could use that for a lot of different things. You could maybe even get one cheaper than that. You know, if you get a, like, a soundboard for, like, audio mixing and stuff and for, like, an XLR mic, which you would need if you had an XLR mic, uh, I think it's possible to get, like, like, there's, like, foot pedals for, like, like, guitars and stuff, I think, that you can get and use like that. Like, I've heard of people just going to music shops and getting some sort of foot pedal that could be used for that. Like, way before Elgato made theirs. Because, as far as I know, this thing from Elgato is fairly new. I try to look at their stuff every once in a while. But, I mean, they have, like quietly released a couple of really good capture cards as well, so it's pretty badass. Like, they used to have, the best they had was the 4K60, so you could capture 4K gameplay at 60 FPS, but then that's all you could pass through as well, right? So if you were capturing gameplay at 4K, you could only see it at 4K60, and a lot of people that are on PC, you know, their monitors are capable of, like, 144 hertz and shit, so you want to be able to have like as much as possible, like an unlimited output basically, and uh, just their older ones wouldn't do it, so but now they the ones they have now do Roger. Escort. Strike team, get to the coordinates to begin rover escort. Yeah, I know, Billy. That's something I was talking about yesterday or the day before. I think it's like, if I really wanted to make the most of any challenge, or, you know, if I wanted to play at my absolute best for any kind of speed run or anything like that, it would have to be off stream. Like, the reason I stream is for the interaction, so I don't want you guys to think that I don't want you to chat, because I absolutely do want you to chat. But that adds to the challenge, you know, and it makes it a lot more difficult. Which, if you stream, you know that, and you can appreciate the fact that what you're seeing in the gameplay is probably not, it, not that person at their best. And if you see somebody that's good at a game and they can read chat as well, then they're really good at that game because it's hard to take your focus away from a game long enough to even read chat, especially to comprehend it, right? Try to follow along with a conversation that's happening about 20 to 30 seconds in the past with multiple people while focusing on a game that needs almost all of your attention. Like, it's very tough. But, you know, a lot of people don't stream and they probably don't realize, you know, that that's a big part of it. That, that you, you sacrifice a bit of your own personal ability. Quad Gaming, I appreciate it, man. Hope you're having a good Friday, dude. Appreciate you pack a punch in the like button. 
You're feeling a bit frosty. Oh, good. You didn't send anybody flowers today, did you? <laughs> Anomaly identified. Closer scan required. Dragon's Dogma 2 is next. Oh, yeah. Lewis, I don't know if you're still in here, but... I see you've been playing that a lot. What do you think of that game, man? Because I have been thinking about playing it as well. It looks like kind of like a cross between Elden Ring and Skyrim. It looks like a big game, though. Like, it would take you weeks to get through it, you know? So, it would be the type of game... It looks, honestly, like a really good game that I would have to play for, like, a month or two straight. So, you know, I probably have to wait... Like, if I want to play that, I need to wait until it's, like, all I'm playing. You just beat Ronin? What the hell is Ronin? I don't think I ever heard of that. Really fun, has a good balance of challenge. Yeah, I've heard it's a little difficult. Like, I was reading the reviews and they're saying it's not a hand-holdy game. You, you pretty much have to go out and figure it out. Which I think would leave a bit for content, you know? That's something I'm always looking for is a game that I can come into and, and learn it. I tend to learn games... Well, pretty fast. Rise of the Ronin. Hmm. I'll have to look into that one. I don't think I've heard of it. I think you know what? I think I have seen it on like the Xbox homepage or whatever. Like, because they're always putting ads on there of, of different games, you know, or just showing you different games. Let's eliminate. Weaver, our disruptor satellite has good alignment. Ready to breach. We're on it, Carver. Uplink terminal should be just ahead. death machine fire bitch could have been right there Strike team. 
Collect any Ethereum left behind. You'll need it. Oh, you dirty bastard game. Activate the beacon to it's definitely a slow run, too. It feels like we're 16 minutes in on wave four. To hit 30, you would think I'd have to be done with five by, like, the 15-minute mark. Then again, some of the objectives are just slow, right? Like, hold out. I think we've had hold out and defend already. Oh, I should have bought a war machine. Okay. Okay. Nice and slow. Almost think I should spawn with the size, dude. They're like the fastest movement you can get without the Electro Bolt. Sure, why not, game? I hate you. I hate you so much. Good God. Let me just stop you right there and leave. Fuck that. Ass. Just straight ass on the RNG. Bullshit, you guys. I'm gonna go. Callie and I are gonna go get some freaking Taco Bell. It's gonna take us a while. But we're gonna do it anyway, cause it's good. And we haven't we haven't had it in months. So yeah, thanks for watching you guys. Hope you have a good Friday. I might come back later. Or I might just post a video or something, I don't know. But if I don't see you guys tonight, then I'll see you tomorrow. Or maybe the next day. But have a good one. Take it easy, Frosty. Boom, Lewis, K Quad Gaming, Billy Wonka. Ethan. Anyone else that might be out there? Dars. You guys have a good rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.